and welcome to another edition of Sean's View Entertainment on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe with some breaking news coming out of the Pacquiao Mayweather fight from last night. New details that we are all learning this morning. According to Yahoo Sports, Pacquiao fought Mayweather at 60 to 75%. Manny Pacquiao fought with injured right shoulder. Pacquiao was also denied a shot in the locker room. Now, trainer Freddie Roach said the injury occurred when Pacquiao threw a right hand during camp approximately a month ago. There was no doctor available to explain the injury, but Pacquiao uh, promoter Bob Arum said it was the same injury that Lakers star Kobe Bryant suffered that ended his 2014-2015 season. Now, there's a lot we can take from this. Uh, is this a legitimate injury? Is there facts? Is there evidence? Now, here's the thing. I mean, Manny Pacquiao threw a lot less uh, than, than Floyd May Money Mayweather did. You know, a lot of people in the comment section were saying, what was this, dancing with the stars? I mean... Where was the effort? Where was the consistency? You know, how can Mayweather be as good as boxer as he is? Well, you know, you know, he hit, you know, he stayed on the defense. The thing is, at the end of the day, though, now that we know the details that, you know, potentially his shoulder was injured going into this thing, did that really affect his hitting power? Did that affect his range of motion? I would have to assume it did. Taking that as if this story was legitimate and he was only competing at about 60 to 75%. You got to wonder now, is there going to be a rematch after all these people in the pay-per-view machine crashed last night over who knows how many pe who, who knows how many buys, one of the richest f boxing matches in the history of the sport of boxing and Rich definitely raised the bar at an all-time high. There is no other match now that's going to, uh, you know, surpass this. There's no other boxing fight that is going to come close to many Money Mayweather versus Manny Pacquiao. But you got to wonder now, you know, how much legitimacy is behind this. Did Pacquiao go into this, you know, and, and why didn't he look into this? You know, there could have been MRIs done. You know, maybe maybe Pacquiao didn't want to, you know, slow up the momentum of this match and have it be, you know, once again canceled only to set it for another date. Maybe Pacquiao didn't want to, uh, you know, deal with the uh, circumstances that would have come out in the backlash had he said, well, you know, going in, I have an injured shoulder. You know, we're only learning about this after the fight. So, you know, I, I don't know if, you know, no excuses on his part. I mean, if there was any excuses, he probably would have said it before the fight even happened. So, ladies and gentlemen, you know, this is definitely something crucial. And I don't know if this gives people something to think about, Pacquiao, with that, sh that shoulder injury. And um, if that really truly affected his performance and what we witnessed in the ring. Because I know we could have seen a lot better from Pacquiao. Um, he did get a few good shots and he got a few good body shots. He had to actually switch his game up. Pacquiao had to... Go in a different direction in this fight, as we all witnessed. He changed the game, but still in the end, uh, M Money Mayweather proving why he's pound for pound one of the best in the game today. Your comments, your opinions, subscribe.